Alright everybody, good evening and welcome back. What we got in front of us tonight are some uh, some flat iron steaks. Now I've done these once before and I just went ahead and I, you know, I seared them off on both sides real quick. But today what we're going to do is we're going to cold smoke these. And in the tin foil I got some cut up potatoes with some seasoning and some olive oil in it. So we're going to use two grills today. And uh, we're going to cold smoke these two flat iron steaks on the Weber Smoky Mountain with the amazing smoke tube in the bottom. And then I'm going to fire up the Weber Smoky Joe to cook those potatoes and to sear that off. Or to sear the flat iron steaks off. So real easy. The way I'm getting these prepped up today, the last time I did them, I did a uh, marinade on them. Today I am not. Today I'm just going to hit it with some A1 sauce, just as a binder. And now it doesn't need much. This stuff spreads pretty good. And I never thought of using A1 steak before, or A1 steak sauce as a binder, but that's what I'm using it for tonight. And it'll, you know, besides being a binder, it should give it just a little bit of flavor. And then uh, for the seasoning, we're going to go ahead and we're going to hit it with some of this uh, Killer Hogs all-purpose rub. And we're just going to go on super, super light. And I already did the other side. And uh, yeah, these are going to set out on the oven top here, probably for about five minutes. And uh, I will pick back up when we're downstairs and throw them on the grill. Okay, so we're down at the Weber's. Uh, first things first, you might notice that I got the uh, Weber grilling table. I've been searching high and low for this thing. I've been able to find it online, but it's usually always like 150 bucks. And uh, wouldn't you know what, I went to a, whole, uh, a, a hardware store here just outside of town and found it for $59.99. So I went ahead and picked that up. So what we got going on in the Smoky Joe right now is we got the potatoes. Got some Royal, o or sorry, some uh, B and B All Natural Lump, and then in the Smoky Mountain, so we got some good smoke going out of there. We got our amazing smoke tube in the bottom. Uh, they got the, I believe it's a 12 inch one, and uh, we're gonna cold smoke these steaks for one hour, and we're gonna sear them off on the Smoky Joe. So besides that, go ahead and close this thing back down, and uh, I will pick back up when we're time to sear them off. So we are back. It's time to sear these off. We will go ahead and pull them right off of the Smoky Mountain. I'm gonna have to do these one at a time and uh, toss it right on to the Smoky Joe. We got some hot coals here. I'm thinking we're gonna probably sear these for about two minutes a side, and uh, I think that's all it's gonna take. So I'll pick back up in about two more okay, minutes. Two minutes are up. Let's go ahead and give these a flip. Yeah, I might have to go a little more than uh, two minutes a side. But uh, I'll let them go for another two minutes and then I'll pick back up then. Okay, another two minutes is up. Let's go ahead and give another flip. I'm gonna go for another two minutes and I'll pick another two minutes has gone by. Go ahead and give her a turn. Go ahead and give her a turn. And I'm thinking uh, two more minutes and uh, these will be done. So we will pick back up when it's time to eat. Alrighty, so when it's time to eat, you can see uh, what I did when, when I brought it in here is I just kind of let it sit on here for a few minutes, let it rest, let some of the juices come back out of it. And yeah, go over to Total Cook Time. Total Cook Time today, we let it go for about an hour and five minutes on the Weber Smoky Mountain. Uh, just with the amazing smoke tube, the pellets we used today was the Lumberjack competition i believe it is uh maple hickory cherry and yeah seared it for what well, ended up being four minutes aside next time i think when i when i do these i'm gonna make sure i get my smoky joe just a little hotter because it didn't quite sear how i wanted it but you can see i don't know you can see i mean that's almost pretty perfect medium rare and uh go ahead and take a bite hmm Melts in your mouth. That is fantastic. I really do like, I uh, got the idea from my dad to kind of cold smoke some steaks with your uh, smoke tube. So besides that, I'm going to go ahead and eat. Guys and girls, have a good night, and uh, we'll see you next time.